nine apps that help me achieve ultimate brand perception across all of my stores and help me stay organized. Guys, these apps are important because you wanna make sure your store looks legitimate so that you're able to charge more for your products and rightfully so. It's all about brand perception and organization and these apps absolutely kill it for these reasons. Check it out in this vid, I'm gonna go through all of them. All right, guys, before we get into this one, I just wanna say thank you so much for helping me get 200 subscribers. I'm very thankful for all this progress that I've done. It's only been, this is the 29th day I'm making my 29th video today since I started on January 1st, and I'm very grateful, guys. As a thank you, I'm gonna actually launch a 30 minute consulting call, at least for every other video that I make. And all you have to do is just drop a comment down below, comment about anything, like, dislike the video, I don't care, just show some feedback. I wanna hear from you guys. It's very important that I, I hear from you so I can grow and tailor myself to help you guys better. So thank you for all the DMs you've sent me on Instagram. Thank you for all the comments and suggestions that you've, that you've posted and thank you so much for subscribing. So if you want to enter in this 30 minute consulting call, all you have to do is drop a DM in this video and I'll reach out to you and I'll post in the following video, which is tomorrow, who the winner is of the consulting call. I will pick at random. Okay, let's get right into it. So the first app I'm gonna suggest is the Beautify. All right, so the Beautify is excellent when you're first starting off because it makes things very simple and it keeps a lot of applications in one theme. They have, I think, like 40 something apps uh, and it just keeps things streamlined because you don't want to install too many applications on your Shopify because it'll slow down your page. It's better to have an optimized page with less apps than it is to have an, a page that's very slow, uh, slow loading with tons of apps because people are have very low attention spans nowadays. So if it takes too long to load onto your website, they're just going to click out. You don't want that to happen. So always check your page speed core score and we'll go over this in another video as well on how to improve it. But what we're going to do is we're going to cover these uh, apps and I'm going to break it down for you on an overview and then I'll make videos on each one of these apps. So Debutify, I'm going to leave it at that. It's a very good starting uh, uh, theme, especially if you're building a general store. It's very easy to make with Debutify. It looks very professional, very, uh, very clean, and it's kind of unique. You can tailor it to look unique as well. Uh, it has things like quantity breaks. It has uh, in-cart timers, minor little things. You know, volume discounts are very useful. Uh, on Debutify, it looks unique. Even the savings, the price savings and the footer section, the header section, it all looks very clean and streamlined and it's a very, very fast theme. That's the important part. So I'm very happy to pay for the Hustler version of it. And they have a free version, but I pay for the Hustler, which includes something like 40 different applications that I use most of, like 30 of them I use. Uh, so Debutify is the number one app that I use for my general stores. Once I discover the product is winning, I'll take it onto another store. I'll still use the Beautify. However, I'll use gem pages or custom uh, HTML to build the product page for that single product store or niche store. Now let's move on to the next one. So uh, we have the reviews apps. Reviews are very important and everyone and their mother suggests Luke's. And I started off as Luke's. Most of you probably did start off using Luke's and it's great and all. However, it is very basic. You do not want to be basic. You want to differentiate yourself and drive that social proof through a unique manner that's not commonly found. And that's why I use Alley Reviews. It just looks more, it looks more uh, professional. It looks better. It looks more verified. It looks more legitimate as a reviews application. That's why I use it. Uh, Judge Me is a good number two choice. Alley Reviews, I believe is $10 per month. Judge Me, I believe is free unless you wanna use things like uh, posting, uh, editing the pictures that you choose for your reviews and whatnot. It's also very easy to import on Judge Me. It's not as easy on Alley Reviews, but you could type it out, copy and paste on Alley Reviews rather than importing. And you don't need a lot of reviews to begin with, so it shouldn't be a big issue. Again, I'll have a video separate just for these applications alone. There's so much to talk about, so much little minor details that you need to know to help generate sales. And you'll learn all of this as you do business, but I'm trying to condense it for you guys so you can focus on just doing what's best instead of trial and error constantly. So that's the goal of these videos. Pause, pause, pause. Everybody stop what you're doing. Stop, pause. Vibe check. All right, guys, this is just some proof to show you guys that I'm not BSing you or talking out of my butt. I just want to show you guys quickly. This application is called Accountify. It shows you your revenue, your profits, and your uh, costs so that you can stay organized. It's a very important application. I totally forgot to mention it in the video as well, so definitely download it. It is free. And here is some more proof that I'm not BSing y'all, so I'm going to quickly refresh this. As you can see, we scaled the store super hard, really fast. So uh, no BS here. Uh, this is one of my newest stores. If you know what you're doing, once you have enough experience, you can definitely get to the scaling point very quickly. But definitely take your time to learn this while I'm making these videos. 
All right, let's get back to it. All right, so the next one is a post-purchase upsell application. Now you've heard of upsell applications and those are just as useful. When you add to cart, you'll see a pop-up. The Beautify has that actually already built in, so I use that. But for post-purchase, which is actually even better because once a customer buys a product, they're in a buying mood. They wanna buy more products, actually. It's psychologically proven to be a fact. So you want to actually upsell in every way possible. Post-purchase upsells are critical. I use Reconvert. Reconvert post-purchase upsell is actually free to use. Uh, and I think they don't charge you until you actually generate a sale using their application. So why not? Do it. It's very good. It's very useful. They already have templates that you can use, such as the conversion monster template. You just tweak it up a little bit and you're good to go. It takes five minutes, 10 minutes to set up, guys. Just do it. It's free. There's no excuse to that. All right. The next thing for social proof and customer care is Tidio Live Chat. Tidio Live Chat is also free to use. And it, basically, you've seen it before. It's a little live chat box in the bottom right or bottom left, wherever. Uh, that your customer could click on and ask questions. If you have customer service representatives, this is very important, or you could do it yourself when you're first starting off to get information about what your customers are asking. This is very important because you want to know the right, the type of questions your customers are asking so that you can put those questions in the description and convert more people because someone might have a question that you did not even think about, but you'll see it in Tidio when they ask you it. And they might just click off if they don't see the question answered in the description. Therefore, when you see a customer asking questions often in, in the Tidio live chat, you're going to want to put those questions answered in the description. That's a very big key right there, guys. And that's one of the reasons why I use Tidio, but also use it for social proof. I use it for reassurance that my website is legitimate and I have services available to help you uh, check out during the process. Or if you check out and you have questions afterwards, there's going to be someone there to help you out throughout the whole process from A to Z. Okay guys, the next one is CJ dropshipping and I've talked about this in a previous video. It's very important to use this because CJ actually takes your uh, customer's order and automatically fulfills it for you. So you don't have to really worry about it. Uh, definitely check out my previous video. One major key that I missed out in that video was the fact that CJ will automatically upload tracking information within 24 to 48 hours as soon as your customer places the order. Even if they have not shipped that order yet, they will provide that tracking information and this is critical for payment processors to trust your business and give you credibility and so they don't put any holds on your account. PayPal and Shopify love to see tracking information uploaded frequently and as fast as possible, especially if it comes from if it's products coming from the United States. Now, if you if you order with CJ and you use one of their shipping methods, USPS from China, it'll show that it's actually coming from the United States. Therefore, when Shopify asks you, "Hey, we need to see 10 tracking informations," you could send them the 10 tracking informations used with USPS shipping methods that show it's coming from US. Therefore, they know it's not drop shipping and they trust you more and they allow you to get more credibility and won't put holds on your account. All right, the next one is TrackyPal. TrackyPal syncs your tracking information on Shopify right to your PayPal so you don't have issues with payment processing. I have a video on how to avoid payment processing holds and I talk about this. TrackyPal is $10 a month. It's very, 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 very useful because you want to make sure your tracking information is automatically uploaded to PayPal so you don't have any holds. PayPal needs to reassure themselves that your business is legitimate and you're actually providing tracking information right away. Keeps things organized, keeps your customers happy, and if you have any disputes, it automatically has the tracking information already tied to it so you have, you're in a better leverage position in that already. All right, the next one is a tracking order tracking software, order tracking applications such as Tractor or Parcel Panel. I've used both and frankly, uh, Tractor is a little bit more complicated to use. The interface is not uh, intuitive as, as Parcel Panel is. Parcel Panel automatically uh, sets everything up for you right away. You barely have to do anything and I think it's actually a lot cheaper than Tractor. However, I do use both on several different stores. Uh, I'm indiscriminate at this point because I have experience with both of them. If you're just starting off, Honestly, pick either or. It'll work. You just need to make sure that your customers are able to track your orders efficiently. You can put it in the footer saying tracking link here. Also, put, make sure you put it in order confirmation emails um, say, uh, showing the tracking information or the tracking link to their, to their order as soon as possible because this reassures the customer that the order is actually on the way and then you're not on a scamming website. All right, guys, I'm sure you've heard of this next one. It's Clavio. Clavio is very important. It's email marketing. You need to set up your back end. You need to set up your email marketing properly. It'll generate you more money. Uh, just like a reconvert, purchase, post-purchase upsell and upsells, they 
generate you free money. You need Clavio. It'll essentially what I do is I use Clavio to divide to, to make a template, and I'll have a video on this as well, showing you my template and showing you how to replicate it. So stay tuned. But you can use you can make your own template, a unique template that shows an order tracking email, and you can sync it to your Shopify so that it sends that email right away as soon as a customer places an order. It looks very professional, and you can have frequently bought items with that email. So some people even buy more stuff as they get the order confirmation email. And I'll also set up different emails for different stages of the shipping, uh, such as your pro your order has shipped out, your order is on its way, your order has been delivered. I'll have emails all made by Clavio uh, and sent to the customer so it looks professional and neat and organized. Brand perception is key. Clavio also helps with the abandoned cart uh, conversion. So if someone at, uh, puts their email down uh, and the abandoned cart and then they leave their cart, Clavio will automatically send them an email as if you set it up as a flow. I'll show you how to do this later on. Uh, so that you can get that person who abandoned the cart to purchase again. So I'll send them three emails after they abandon the cart at different times set by Clavio with a personable, um, customized email template. And this generates, uh, this brings back my, my abandoned carts. So the key is to just try to get as much sales as possible to come through with the money you spend on advertising. So you definitely want to set up your backend properly. Email marketing is critical. Uh, you must, 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 must do it. Learn more about it. Look it up on YouTube or stay tuned for another video completely on Clavio on its own. It's so important, guys. Okay, just like Clavio, SMS bump actually does the same thing but with numbers. So if someone leaves a phone number instead of an email, SMS bump will automatically text them, hey, you forgot this item in your cart. Hey, I reserved your 10% discount along with the current discount that we have with on our website. Uh, click, click on this link to get your free track shipping as well. And that on its own also generates a good amount of money. Uh, it's very, very cheap. It's like less than pennies on, on the dollar for every text that you sent with, with a SMS bump. And I believe they give you free credit when you put money in. So definitely use SMS bump alongside Clavio. They're both very, very critical tools. Okay guys, the last one that I have is a very low key application that I use. It's very small, very portable. It's not a big heavy load on your website. It's called CTA buttons. Now essentially what this does is it allows you to put down little buttons just like the chat icon that you get from uh, Tidio so that your customers can click on it if they wanna perform an action such as to call your customer service support line. Now, for especially for stores where I have uh, high ticket order, high ticket products, products that are sold for over thousands of dollars, I need to make sure that the customer knows that we're our customer service team is available around the clock and we're dedicated. And if anything happens, they can just call our line. So what I do is I use the CTA buttons application to add a little phone icon alongside the chat icon right next to each other. So that if a customer uh, goes through the website, sees, you know, okay, I want to make this purchase, but I want to make sure that they're legitimate. If they see that phone icon, they see that we have a number, a legitimate business number, they will feel reassured and they'll feel better and more comfortable with placing the order. They'll understand that you're a big company. They have nothing to worry about, but in reality, you're just a teenager running a whole business behind a computer. <laughs> so it's all about brand perception, guys. If you take anything from this video, please understand that you need to create a brand around the products that you want to scale. You don't necessarily have to do this in general stores, although it's helpful to create a brand identity in the general store. It's critical to create a brand identity that drives value to the customer for one product stores and niche stores. Guys, spend your time on this and also spend your time on getting apps that keep you organized, all right? That's why I've been talking over, that's why I went through all of these apps, that's why I still use all of these apps. Keep your page, keep your page speed score low. Make sure it's, uh, the load time is fast. Make sure you have applications to help you drive as much sales as possible because you're spending money on advertisement. You might as well generate more sales from your traffic. And also stay organized. You need to stay organized. That's why I use uh, um, an app. Uh, that's why I use CJ, honestly. They just help me stay organized in every way possible from order fulfillment to tracking and everything else. Uh, I'm gonna put a link for CJ down in the description. It is an affiliate link, so I will get benefit if you help me out for there. Uh, but you know, if you watch my previous video, you'll see that I clearly use it. I've spent, I think, $130,000 just in cost of goods sold in the past 30 days from CJ Dropshipping. So I'm not BSing you, and that's only for two of my stores. So uh, guys, again, I wanna thank you one more time for watching my videos. I wanna thank you for subscribing and liking. Uh, I tend to talk fast, and that's why I don't wanna waste your time. I wanna get straight to the point. So if you have any suggestions, any feedback for me, I'm very, very much so looking forward to it. I wanna hear it. Send me DMs. I'm answering every single DM that I get. I just started, so I'm still trying to help you guys out. Uh, 
and that's about it. Any suggestions, give me a shout. I'm here to help and let's get straight to the money guys. Best of luck and never, ever, ever, ever give up y'all. Peace.